but I remember growing up in Kenya was ever music was always in the house always in the house and this includes growing in the town and growing in the in the rural areas as well because there were these um, gospel music that uh, kids in the neighborhood used to sing and rap and you know they know everything they had crammed everything and you, when you go to school you and I buy song and then you and Punzo Mwingine and oh the story goes on and on and on but music oh my god music thumbs up another point I mean traffic jam Jamia Nairobi Hmm. If you have ever spent hours and hours in the jam, then you know what I'm talking about. Like, I mean jam, especially in the capital city, Nairobi. I mean Nairobi. Oh my God. Oh my God. I thank God I never ever... I was never ever caught in the jam while going to work where I was supposed to be at this specific time. But I can tell traffic jam in Kenya is horrible. Horrible. Just don't try being caught in the jam, in the traffic jam. I mean, jam. Damn stop. It's a pity. It's a pity. I mean, the Kenyan jam would could last and continue lasting for three, four hours. You are on the way. You're going. You are going somewhere. Not even, not even 20 kilometers, maybe 10 kilometers away from town. And you are, you are just in Pika Road. You are supposed to go to Mozaiga. And I'm telling you from from Vika Road to Mozaiga, I'm at to I don't know Kahawa West or I don't know wherever you would get stuck there. Nothing is moving. You are just in the in the mat, just inside the mat. Like in this uh, you are moving in the snail you just move kidogo 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 oh my god Jam. I will not support this unfortunately no I have never ever in my life experienced jam as big or as horrible as back in Kenya this 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 is this is no nothing to joke around it's thumbs down please 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 kenya the minister of i don't know transport or the responsible authorities for the jam for the traffic system please do something do something because even right now jam is an issue in our country it's terrible it's terrible you don't move especially in the rush hours morning hours for those going to work you have to wake up like four to avoid the jam the jam in Mombasa road in Jogo road in uh, I don't know where Thika road <sighs> it's crazy it's crazy really crazy really crazy well and to our last point Matatu culture. Matatu. With this, I mean mat. Who can tell me has never enjoyed matatu? While in Kenya, like who? Oh my God, matatus. Like living in Kenya without matatus, this is a no go. This is a no go. Matatus make the whole traffic system the whole transportation just awesome it's lively it's oh my god these matatus you know 
you know, you just sit in a matatu and the music that's playing there is wow well, it you you okay you just sit there and think like okay i'm heading to to meet somebody sometimes you will just sit there and think like oh my god am i in a club am i in a church like you don't even want to move because they are playing really good music and the mu the you know the atmosphere the that uh, vibe in the mat, in the matatu, in the bath is awesome. It's just amazing. Without mentioning all the chaos with the driver and the makangas and stuff, just matatu itself, the matatu, getting into uh, that matatu, matatu za buru, matatu za rongai, matatu za gedorai, or I don't know all over nairobi all over um, i don't know i don't want to mention it's all over kenya anywhere you have the matatu you enjoy the transport system without mentioning the